here at Clear Lake Park for the Greek Festival. Yep. The people are here, the music is going, and the, the wine is food going. is awesome. Specifically. The gyros. Oh, heroes. Yeah. <laughs> Whatever. And that saklovaki. Slovaki. Oh, my God, that's good. That, that is, is really good. good. That is pork with um, Greek Greek seafood. Greek oregano. Wonderful. And they have the bread they serve with it, uh, butter and lemon juice and salt and Greek oregano. It's very good. It is very good. And my favorite wine is the Retsina. Uh-huh. I had a sip of that. It was really good. Yeah, it is. It's got some turpentine in it. Yeah. Well, it was very small, so it probably won't kill you. <laughs> Anyways, we're going to have a great time. Yes, we are. Yes, we are. Opa! Opa! The Greek <laughs> Festival is finally here! Yay! <laughs> this is your opening night. It's going wonderful and everybody's having a good time. They're enjoying the music and the food and the entertainment, so everything's going great. Speaking of entertainment, what can we expect? We have Alex, the Golden Greek, the bazooki player, and then we have Asteria, which is the young adults that are going to be doing the traditional Greek dances, and we also have the little angels who are going to be doing the traditional Greek dances as well. I'm with Jose Guadiano. How long have you been working with the children at their dances? For about three years, my wife Kika got me involved in dancing with the children. It's an absolute pleasure for me to dance with them. You look it's like fun. you were enjoying yeah. yourself. Oh, I, I do, I do. Now explain the dance to me that they did with the pole. Well, it's something like the maypole dance. We came up with the idea to do this dance to great music. And the kids Clever. are loving it. They just love this dance. So, Kika, the dances were wonderful. The kids are adorable. How long have you been teaching them? I, I've been teaching almost all my life, I think. I taught some in New Orleans, taught in Galveston, the Greek Orthodox community there, and then here in the Clear Lake area. And I'm thinking it's probably 30 years. Oh my goodness. Yeah. So is there a significance to uh, the dances that the children were doing? We tried to get from all over Greece. Some are from the islands, some are from North Greece, some are from the Athens area, you know, like the, the uh, Zorba is really a sailor's dance, so it's South. Yeah, there's there's a lot of feeling that goes into it. There's a lot of uh, passion. <laughs> Wonderful. So, Thank you, Kika. Thank you.